Alrighty, well, morning everybody. Uh, well, this is gonna be what I call the express version of my cast. Or, actually, in the grand scheme of things, this is uh, gonna be an old, old school version of the cast videos that I, that I, that I first did when I first started making these. And the reason being is because I actually did make a full-blown one earlier with, uh, video and everything, with video and images and all that. Uh, the problem is, is, uh, I ended up fucking up the recording because if I have any kind of, uh, if I'm using any kind of, uh, any video files on my computer that I'm on my, on my, uh, on my cast, I have to make sure to shut them down immediately after using them. Otherwise, my, uh, my OBS program will hang. It won't stop recording. And, um, the only way to stop it is by disabling it or shutting it down through my task manager. And that, which, uh, results in my, uh, in my recording becoming corrupted, un unusable, meaning I have to delete it. So basically, um, I bas short answer, I just fucked up. So, so now what I gotta do here is, again, this is just gonna be a short, short version. Um, this is the way I used to do it when I first started doing these casts, but, uh, the name of the music is Dior Wegg. The Forlorn Call of Ages, Old School Dungeon Synth. I just grabbed the first thing that was available. So, so let me go ahead and get that going. Yeah, I didn't. But anyway, um, I'm also having a can of V8 Energy Orange Pineapple Flavor. But, uh, but, uh, I'll go ahead and say that, uh, going forward, I am phasing out V8 energy drinks. I guess I could do that. But, yeah, I'm, I'm phasing these out. They are too expensive, and I'm working part-time now. So, these are the things I used to drink a lot of back when I was working full-time. But, again, since I'm not making as much money, I can't really afford them now. So, what I am going to be drinking instead is going to be Arizona tea. Oh, and also, I will no longer, I have completely phased out uh, canned chicken breast. I used to have a can of that every day. Um, and I'm probably going to be phasing out my tuna fish sandwiches as well. But I got to... But I might keep them. I don't know. It, the jury's still out on it. But until that time, I've replaced my uh, chicken breast with um, dark red kidney beans and pinto beans. But this isn't a sacrifice on my part, though. I Back at least a year ago, maybe two years ago, when I was playing a game called Path of Exile, these are what I ate and drank while I streamed. So, so nothing unique there. Uh, but otherwise, I've, I've been, um, been listening to a lot of comfy synth. For those that don't know what that is, it's a type of music where it's, it's basically kid-friendly music. Um, like the kind you, you know, you, like you, you tuck your kids in and with, you know, that kind of thing, but, uh, but, uh, I'm what, but it's not a, it's not a genre I listen to a lot, I listen to a lot or anything. But I have, you know, I'll have my mood, I'll have my moods to where, or sometimes I'll just get a hankering to listen to this kind of music. Um, I listened to a fair amount of it yesterday, though. There's a brand new uh, channel, a brand new YouTube channel that came out, uh, came out about a week ago. So they don't quite have a big catalog yet, because I am starting to hear some repeats. But I'm actually finding a lot of the thumbnails they use pretty trippy, like more trippy than like like psychedelic art you know the 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 tie-dye you know acid you know acid trip kind of imagery i'm actually finding some of the imagery on here to be more trippy than that stuff i think probably one of the reasons why is just because the artists that are making these kind of uh comfy synth images i'm pretty sure they're not doing drugs you know you know kind of the same lines as uh the satanic metal, all the satanic imagery they use. 
I mean, yeah, pretty scary stuff, but it comes as no surprise to me. I mean, they're devil worshippers. So, whereas uh, the images that I'm seeing on this channel, it's like, Jeez! it's like uh, pretty intimidating stuff. But again, a good chunk of the reason why is just the the, the artists, they're, they're completely sober. Or at least that's what I'm guessing anyway. And, um, and if, if not for the fact that uh, this channel is actually putting the uh, all the uh, artist in, all the, uh, the song information right on the thumbnail, it kind of it kind of interferes or it kind of detracts from the pictures. That I'd, I'd I'd actually have one or two of them on my desktop background, but but yeah, it they it, it, it kind of gets ruined by all this uh, annotations. I think that's the word I'm looking. So, so yeah, there's that, and I've also been playing a lot of Gems of War too. So, but yeah, the my current team, um, I've re I've changed their name to the Pinball Team, cause um it. The, the team I'm using now, it's practically RNG-based. So, kind of like pinball. Um, it's, just, it's like one, it's like one moment, it's... Ultra combo! Holy shit. And then on the very next turn, it's... <laughs> so, pinball's like that, too. Like, I, I get up. Uh, like one moment it'll be and then another moment later it'll be it's official. You suck. so it's a it's a very roller coastery team that I got I mean but if I'm if I'm beating opponents with it it's a freaking thing of beauty and if I if, and if I can't or if the RNG is like really really bad then the other team pretty much owns me you know it's I end up having a re you know, I end up having a retreat from battle, you know, if it's if it's already going bad, where it's up. I kind of did the same thing with my uh, with the other team that I was using. But uh, at least with my other team, it's more surgical. I had actually uh, cherry-picked gems, you know, I had to pick and choose targets and whatnot. So it, it was actually more tedious to use than uh, this team here, and this team that I'm using now. So this this team I'm using now, um, there's I don't have to target anything. So it, so making it very controller friendly, meaning uh, gameplay goes a lot faster. So so it's it's definitely a keeper team though. You know I mean despite the RNG factor, I, I still enjoy playing it. Um, Despite it being frustrating at times, uh, pinball is the same way. I've loved it ever since I was a little kid, but I—it's basically a roller coaster ride with that. So, you know, I make some great shots, but then, then moment, you know, then the next moment I'm getting absolutely fuckoed afterwards. So, a lot of ups and downs. So. Okay, but otherwise, that's gonna be my cast. Uh, like I said, this is just gonna be an express version. Um, I just, um, on my last, on my previous attempt, um, I just, I ro royally fucked up on the technical front, so I basically ruined the entire video, so this is just a short, short version, so, but otherwise, hey, thanks for, uh, tuning in and listening to me, everybody, I appreciate that, and I should be able to do another one of these tomorrow morning, and going forward, I will no longer be using, uh, video files on my videos, so... That's definitely out the window because apparently I can't, I can't, I don't have the mental capacity to, to remember to shut off video files after turning them off. But anyway, I'm kind of babbling on right now. Um, see you guys next time um, and take care.